How do? Chain Rave Games here. Um, about to walk you through the new reveal for the next kill team. It's going to be Kazakin versus Necrons. We'll see what happens, shall we? It does look good. Kyrgyz Elite, the Kazakin. Got your Melter, you got your Vox, you got some little kind of gribblies, some little kind of uh, extra things. And then you got your Necrons, the Agents of the Dynasties. Which, uh. Sorry, I'll just pause it here. You got your Kazakin Sergeant with a chain sword and a plasma pistol, Kazakin Gunner with a flamer, and a Kazakin Sharpshooter. What's next? You've got your Kazakin Demo Trooper. I'm pretty sure in the Death Gora Krieg we've got a Demolitions Expert as well. A Kazakin Trooper, that will be your uh, your bread and butter of your unit. And your Kazakin Vox Trooper, he's going to be uh, shoving a 1 AP wherever he wants to. Oh, and two more. Right, okay. You've got your Kazakin Combat Medic to heal you guys, and your Kazakin Recon Trooper. Ugh, recon. Well, you got your Medic, you got your Vox, you got your. your he's going to be your, uh, your, your scanner guy, isn't he? And then we've got Necrons. Honestly? Bit disappointing. Yeah, for a new, you know, kind of box set, I can see them focusing on the Imperial Guard more. I can understand it. But for the Necrons, for their bespoke kill team to be a Technomancer, a Technomancer that we can get in Imperium Magazine for half the price that you get at a Games Workshop, a Plasma Sight Accelerator, which I'm pretty sure that's the same, well it might not be the same model, but Plasma Sight Accelerator you get with the Scorpic Destroyers, a Death Mark, well, Death Mark's a Death Mark, and then we get an plasma site reanimator which is just a tiddly reanimator I'm pretty sure that's a very similar model to the one you get with the Scorpix anyway an Apprentic so an Apprentic an Apprentice Cryptic out of nowhere but the model itself looks very similar to the uh, the model that came out just recently which was a special model for the Necrons a special Cryptic I can't remember what his name was, but it was like a, the crippled or the, uh, the the crooked or something like that. And then you get an immortal despotic, which for me looks like an immortal on its way to being a uh, oh what are they called a uh, a royal guard. But <sighs> I like Necrons. And I'm very underwhelmed with this reveal. The last reveal was brilliant, like, you know, two brand new teams. But, who is really going to use the Kill Team Navy Breachers in their 40k army? Who is really going to use them? In their 40k army. I know they've had 40k rules now. And. I've not looked at them. But. Wouldn't it have made more sense. To just have the. The Kazakin. Against the Kroot. And then we have. Two extra slots. Later on for. New teams. We need a bespoke Tyranid team. 
we need a bespoke I hate to say it but something like Grey Knights or something like that we didn't need Imperial navvies we didn't need them but we got them and the only reason I'm glad we got them was because of the croup because those croup models are amazing anyway that's my thoughts on the matter much love uh, if you want to put any comments in the comment section well that's where I'd go much love and I'll see you in a bit